Sugary drinks in the crosshairs of lawmakers again. Health and dental organizations say that those sugary drinks contribute and are a leading source of added sugar in the diet that leads to obesity, tooth decay, and potentially other health issues. So again, lawmakers now targeting Coke, Pepsi, Gatorade, Monster, and other sugary drinks. Take a look. Under multiple pieces of legislation to be proposed today, lawmakers would tax sugary drinks to pay for health-related programs, prohibit sugary drinks from being displayed near checkout counters and stores, ban promotional deals to lower the price, cap the size of unsealed drinks in restaurants and grocery stores to just 16 ounces, and would require warning labels about the health risk associated with sugary drinks. Now back out here live, all of this will be unveiled at a uh, event here inside the state capitol later this morning. This isn't the first time though that lawmakers have taken aim at sugary drinks. In fact, over the past decade, at least 11 times lawmakers have tried to either tax or put warning labels on sugary drinks at almost every time. Those efforts barely got off the ground. Lad State Capital, Mike Tissell, KCR Ray 3 News.